First of all, with single tonguing, uh, I always try and make sure that the tongue doesn't move back too far in the mouth. So I can't uh, exactly picture this, but I imagine that my tongue moves back about a centimetre within my mouth because if the tongue is moving too far back, it's just going to take too long to get back to the front. So when I'm practicing my articulation, I do it a lot without the instrument. So I could be walking or I could be washing the dishes, but I'll be and by strengthening my tongue, because it is a muscle. I'm able to, to emulate that and copy that onto the instrument much, much easier. With regards to the tongue position, everyone says use the tip of the tongue. It's very difficult to use the tip of your tongue, otherwise you're almost playing through your teeth, between your teeth. So I kind of use just the, the top part of my tongue, just around about there. And that really enables you to, to keep the tongue nice and short. But for me, it's about repetition, about saying it before practicing it, uh, and then putting it into practice on your instrument, but keeping that tongue as close to the top and to the front of the mouth as possible.